close to 100 food service executives, including more than 60 convenience retailer decision makers, enjoyed store tours, one-on-one conversations, retailer panels, and more at this year's Convenience Food Service Exchange. The event was presented by Convenience Store News this spring. I'm Don Longo, Editorial Director Emeritus of Convenience Store News, and I had the honor of once again emceeing the 2024 Convenience Food Service Exchange for the sixth consecutive year. From Ben Lucky's opening address on developing winning formulas for prepared food, dispensed beverages, and fresh bakery, the closing speaker, Jim Bressy's vision of the evolution and future of convenience food service, this year's event in Tampa, Florida was designed to help C-Store retailers find their secret source or the differentiating factor that sets them up for success in convenience food service. The Food Service Exchange featured its usual variety of keynote presentations, panel discussions, and fireside chats. There was also one-on-one networking and a local history and food tour of Ybor City, famous for its wild chickens of Ybor. The event also included visits to best-in-class C-Store food service market leaders, Wawa and Racetrack Petroleum. This year's conference included three retailer panels, They provided case studies and insights into the strategic thinking behind the food and beverage initiatives of these leading retailers. The first panel was led by Lisa Salaria, Senior Principal Consultant for Impact 21 Group. Tony Sparks of Kirby's Express Market in Lubbock, Texas, and Paul Service of La Crosse, Wisconsin-based Quick Trip participated in a featured session on dispensed beverages. They covered best practices and future flavor trends in hot, cold, and frozen drinks. Business Accelerated Team Consultant Ed Bercher led a panel about the importance of multifaceted engagement strategies. Panelists Mendy Merriweather of Wawa, Ryan Krebs of Endmarket, Babia Sultan of Independent Fave Trip, and former Thornton's executive Todd McFarlane discussed the impact of technology overload and how to build loyalty with guests. One of my favorite sessions was my fireside chat with Sean Barnes, Director of Food Service for Murphy USA. We talked about Murphy's food and beverage strategy and how it's evolving and changing customer expectations. The 2024 Food Service Exchange also featured an annual highlight, the presentation of the Food Service Innovators Awards. This year's winners were Prepared Food Innovators of the Year, Silver Medal Rudders, and Gold Medal winner Twice Daily, Hot and Cold Beverages Innovator of the Year, Silver Medal 7-Eleven, Gold Medal Kirby's Express Market, Best Use of Technology in Food Service, Silver Medal Circle K, Gold Medal Casey's, New Innovators to Watch, Silver Medal on Q, Gold Medal Murphy USA, and our 2024 Overall Food Service Innovators of the Year, Silver Medal Get Go and Gold Medal Wawa. That's it for now. I hope you'll consider joining us for next year's Convenience Food Service Exchange in Denver, Colorado next spring. 